Born in Makati but raised in Alberta, Canada, Kelvin De La Peña became the 15th overall pick of the Alaska Aces back in the 2008 PBA Draft. He made a name for himself by becoming the main man of the Mapua Cardinals in the NCAA and he also was the Rookie of the Year in Season 81 and the MVP in Season 83. He spent four years in the PBA playing for Alaska and San Miguel before returning to Canada and continuing his basketball career there. Oh, Canada. Sean Anthony was the sixth overall pick of the Tw Air 21 Express in the 2010 PBA draft, born and raised in Vancouver. Anthony found himself tracing back to his Filipino roots through basketball. He has played for multiple teams in the PBA, but has been very serviceable for every team that he has played for in the 2015 to 2016 season. Anthony averaged career best of 15 points per game and 9.2 rebounds and, uh, while playing for the NLEX Road Warriors. Hailing out of Toronto, James Forrester introduced himself to Philippine basketball when he suited up for the Arellano University Chiefs in the NCAA. Together with John Pinto and Gio Halalon, they brought Arellano to relevance in the collegiate scene. Soon, he made the leap to the PBA D-League and then into the PBA. He was a fourth overall pick of Barangay Ginebra in the 2013 PBA draft ahead of a guy named Terence Romeo. Well, that's Did a you know pick. that? Did you yeah. know that? Yeah, that's, you know that's a pick that, that. Uh, we talk about over and over again. Now, another Filipino hooper coming out of Toronto is Norbert Torres. Mm. He was born and raised in Canada, but he proved his loyalty to the Philippine flag when he joined the RP youth team in the Siaba Juniors in 2008. They won the gold medal and Torres was named tournament MVP. He helped the Philippines win two more gold medals in 2015 in the Siaba and the Sea Games before becoming the eighth overall pick of the Star Hot Shots in the 2015 PBA Draft. I kid you not, in the Filipino scene of Canadian basketball, that guy was Shaq. This man was Kobe. <laughs> Last but not the least is the Filipino-Canadian Hooper who has helped the Philippines in its rise back to relevance in the global basketball scene. Gilas Pilipinas mainstay Matthew Wright was born and grew up in Toronto, Canada and his first exposure to Philippine basketball was in Filipino leagues in and around Canada with his childhood buddy Norbert Torres. Soon. They found themselves together in the RP youth team back in 2008. Wright continued serving the country, becoming a part of Guinness Filipinas in its bid for the 2019 FIBA World Cup. And he was also part of the special Gilas draft in 2016, where he was chosen by the Phoenix Pulse Field Masters. Matthew Wright will go down in history as one of the very, very few players who did not have to go through the PBA D League because of his service for flag and country.